Hey, what's up everyone? Today we're going to be hopping back into the ultimate red zone. We're going to be going up against Broly this time around, so they added some new missions with part two of the worldwide download celebration. Um, so they want you to beat him with a s one of each type of super class and then one of each type of extreme. So today we're going to try the extreme team, because I know the super one won't be too bad. Um, with all the choices you can pick, plus, you know, the seven-year LRs are just so good. Um, but the extreme team would, will probably be a little tough. And they want you to beat it within eight turns. Omega, they wanted you to beat it within seven turns. Which, surprisingly, we actually did pretty easily. Um, but eight turns. Alright, let's hop in. We'll take a quick look at the team, then we'll, we'll take a better look at it at the end of the video here. Um, so yeah, I am gonna be taking double str cool um not really too sure how well that's gonna go i guess we will see um any support memories we can really take that'll that's just planet namek saga and this one just gives it for one turn attack 15 percent for extreme class um yeah n nobody we're really rocking on planet namek saga so i guess we can just rock a gohan and icarus that's usually my go-to. All right, let's hop in and see how we can do. Everybody is Max Links on the team. All right, let's do this. Let's see how we do. Double STR cooler. We're definitely gonna have to really build him up as quickly as possible. All right, just making sure those are off so you can see Cooler's awesome intro. STR cooler. Hmm, I guess. I, I guess we could just leave it just like this. I mean, this should be fine. Fizz cooler might take some damage there at the end, especially if Broly super attacks. But at least we're we're gonna get a super attack with him before Broly attacks us. Both the metal coolers do gotta build up a little bit. Hope an AGL uh, EZA metal cooler here will, will do some good work for us. Now he's already double super. We'll see how this run goes. Uh, looks like he's super tough the EZA coolers, so that's, that's the best case scenario right there. Yeah, 56 k will take that. Double super in the end. When I say double, I mean like triple, quadruple, pentacle super. I was gonna say, if you had another one coming out, oh my god. Okay, he, he's gonna get fully built up as well here, it looks like. Well, I don't know. I don't know. I think he only has to take four hits, right? Fifteen up to sixty. Yeah, I think that's four hits. Man, this guy. Twenty up to a hundred. He needs to take five hits. Okay. All right. Now we got these guys on rotation. I hmm. I don't really want to float off my cooler. These two are like. An invincible rotation. I mean, not invincible, but uh, pretty good together. So we're, we're just going to keep on rotation. We we'll finish off roll here, and then we'll start building up my cooler next turn. We do got Whis items with us. Um, the AOE phase is really what we're going to have to worry about. Uh, plus the last AGL phase, since it's AGL, the two SQL coolers are definitely going to struggle. 
have enough defense to pan the AGL Broly. Plus he could be super twice in one turn, it's just these kills. Remember, he's like the best tech unit I could think to throw on, really. And there's some other units that we sure as hell weren't rocking down with the LR giant deal, no way. Tech Remember will be good, he's got his guard before he uh, transforms, plus his damage reduction. So now we got a tech phase here. Hmm. Well, this might be bad for AGL Metal Pool. I might float him off for now. And then we'll, we'll get him back around. Too bad Garlic Jr. doesn't raise his defense on Super. This could definitely hurt uh, STR Cooler here, though. Broly decides to Super attack. Slot one. He does a normal there in that first attack, and we should be good, yeah. Cool little bit so. So 12 key super attacks, great he raises defense up. He's still building up as well. Each attack he does he gets some extra attack and defense. Come on, cooler! Super attack, man. Not just the normal. <laughs> Please. Oh no. Alright, we're good, I think. Unless Tech Broly saves it for the very end. If he hits AGL Metal Cooler with a super attack, that could definitely be bad. But it looks like he's going for Garlic Jr. So we got tight advantage. Garlic Jr.'s got like 250k defense, I think, or something. Still took a nice. 191k, almost 200. Better than uh, what EGL Metal Cooler would have been tanking. We wouldn't have tanked at all. We would have just died, probably. I do want to keep physical Metal Cooler around, though. Except the AoE phase, man. I don't know. I get, we're going to have to float him off again. We're not gonna transform in, in with a uh, tech Janemba here. Oh, I gotta run this down slot too, that's right. I gotta get him built up as well. Slowly but surely, let's, let's see how we do this. Extreme team should be able to do it. Um, I imagine there's some other picks you guys could do, but you, know, you gotta take one of each type, so it's kinda, kinda hard to pick and choose who would be the best unit for this stage in particular. Like, I was thinking about Easy AGL Curvis for AGL. And there's Metal Cooler, you got AGL Golden Freezer. Not really too much to pick from tech. Physical, you got LR Janemba or this new LR Metal Cooler. Those are like the two, one of the two best units you could pick for physical ones. So now Janemba's got his guard, Metal Cooler's got his revive. And STR, I mean, I, I just brought the man himself, you know. This beast cooler over here. Ah, uh, I wanna. I want to build up my cooler. Let's do this. I'm going to stick Garlic Jr. in slot 1 here. And then we can give my cooler some attacks. we got to start building him up. Because of that, that is why we stuck Garlic Jr. in slot 1 right there. Another 190 kill. He went for I mean, I don't know. I was thinking about, like, Birder and Jace. I mean, most of these guys are on Space Traveling Warriors. Not everybody, though, like the two Janembas aren't. So 
he, he could have walked in. He had like a 50% chance to dodge. Except you can't dodge in the last phase, so I don't know how well that would have The Garlic Jr. would have been a little bit tankier, unless Birder and Jace have triple secret or something. Alright, alright. We've got Janemba's active skill as well. Do I use it now? Should I wait till his AGL phase? I feel like if I use it now, it's, it's literally not going to do anything because this guy's strength. Um. Do I want to float just now? I'll keep him on for now. Next time he comes around. Nah, I, I wouldn't float him off. I don't think I'm going to, actually. Needs four tight key spheres to get his support ability, but at least he'll get his damage reduction here. Just gotta worry about this AoE, I kinda forgot about it, oh my goodness. That's nice, that's nice, oh that's even nicer. I should have took a wheeze, what was I thinking? Oh, Fizz Metal Cooler. I love Metal Cooler's gonna have to heal us up, man. Like, big time. Need all that HP regen that he's got going on. I wish he had a scouter too. It would be really nice if uh, LR Metal Cool had a scouter so we could see where Broly's super attack and that would help out a lot. Hey, we finally got. I, I thought we would have got this a lot sooner. So this will give us a little bit of extra attack and defense. Out of boy, please. What a cute dragon. Okay, that'll that'll heal us up as well. I might not do too much damage, but that'll definitely heal us up. Let's do it. I'll drain every bit of your life force. <laughs> Splendid. I'll take as much as I please. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, Broly. Get drained. Every last drop. Hmm, what do I do here? I mean... Do I just go for the revive now? Because I feel like... Hmm... I'm gonna... <laughs> I don't know, because like if I stick him out front, like he's, he's gonna A do his AoE again, I think. He, he might as well just, just go for the revive. Because if, if Final Fantasy Cooler dies, we, we won't get the revive. You know, I'm gonna risk it. Let's just see what happens here. Because he might, even on the AoE, he might not kill the uh, STR cooler. If he does decide to super attack. But he will kill another cooler on it. I think. And especially now that he's, he's super attacking, he should be good. So I'd like to save the revive for at least about 10 minutes, 10.1. Alright, LR Cooley. No additional crits or anything other than what I gave him from his hidden potential. Aw oh, man, even the additional super units. I guess, I guess Broly's not uh, doing his AoE this time, but he probably will this time. Yeah, we healed up quite a bit there. Hmm. I'm kind of tempted just to... Let's see, his next phase is, a is AGL. So maybe I should float him off.
I have a feeling he's gonna do his AoE this time. There's no doubt. In my mind that he's not. Um I mean we should survive it. I almost want to pop Cooler's active skill, but I want to save that for the AGL phase as well. Would we survive his AoE attack? Oh man, I don't know. Like, these two would be fine, I feel like, but... No, oh, again, yeah, let's just risk it. We'll, we'll be alright. I think. Oh, he didn't. In the first slot, at least. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, let's save our leases for the last phase, man. Ooh, an AGL metal cooler man getting these double supers, I'm liking it. We need all the damage. Yeah, that crit just finished him off. Heck yeah, man. Alright, alright, alright. We're looking good. Honestly, let's just let's just do this. Well first let's pop this. I'm not short-sighted like my brother. I will be sure to exterminate every last one of you! Say goodbye! This is a good one! Oh, cool. Nice crit, man. We should be able to get the revive off right here. Yeah. If, especially if you, like, super slot one there. Look at how many times Metal Cool is getting attacked. We could eat, yeah, we could definitely easily get the revive off right here. Unless that was a super attack. Oh, there it is. Okay, okay. Yeah, we're toast. That's fine. We still got two Weezies plus this revive that we're about to get. 878k. Alright, bro. You will take all you can muster. Even then, I'll only be resurrected with more strength than before. Put simply, you'll never defeat me. Oh man, yeah, that's the first time I got to see the revive there. Looking good. I'm thinking we're gonna give AGL AGL cooler the Dokkan attack as well. I think, because I feel like he'd be hitting harder than Janemba, honestly. Let's do Janemba's Rage at this point. <laughs> Alright, looks like we got plenty of key to choose from here. Nice, nice paths for us to take. <laughs> We're able to get two of his super attacks. Not as HP though. This is basically just a nice free turn for us. Get a little bit of damage off on the other one. This is the Mars Blade. Super attack on the third one. Yeah, 1.16 million. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, so we still got our same rotation. I'm just gonna pop the Whis. You know we need it. I'm honestly tempted to double Whis, but. We should be okay. I kind of want to stick Janemba out front. What's he got? 363k defense. Yeah, that's pretty good. Um, I would want to give the Dokkan attack to HL Cooler. He'd probably hit harder, but... Honestly, Janemba here... With his guard and stuff like that... And I think he, he should be fully built up by now. There's no way he's not. Garlic Jr.'s got 219k defense, plus the Wii's... We should be alright. Even if Broly super attacks Scarlet Jr., I mean, I well, Kinda scared. I honestly. 
We're gonna risk it. But I've double weast before, and then you're like. Time to get gold. serious! You don't have to worry at all. If you save the weases for the end and just double weas, you're good. Gonna go on. Out one, of my, one of my other videos. Getting, uh, the ultimate red zone against a metal cooler. And we just absolutely destroyed him. That was a, that was a fun run. We got the rewind of Tom and Goku. Before we even got to Metal Cooler, it was, it was good stuff. Ooh, nice 8 mil from Jinemba right there. That was good. It's 6.6. .6. Oh, yeah! He just straight up absorbed Broly's super attack right there. Wow. I wonder if we even needed to take a Whis. I don't know. If he super attacks Garlic Jr. here at the end, because he can't super attack uh, two times in a turn. Attack Garlic Jr. and just kill us instantly. Then I would have had to take the double ease. He's taking 25k, 20k. Yeah, Broly probably definitely could have killed us right there if he did super attack Garlic Jr. But hey, now we got this one. I'm not short sighted like my brother. I will be sure to exterminate every last one of you. Say goodbye. This is your Come on, cooler, my man. Where was the crit? Alright, so on this rotation, we still have our first Reese active, but we're definitely gonna need this other Reese. Because, you know, these guys are STR. They need that 80% damage reduction, and we're not really uh, surviving Broly here without a double Reese, honestly. I don't know if, yeah, one Reese one probably would be enough. Uh, Unless Kudo got his uh, super packs in first, which we should So we should be good. We might even finish him this turn if we the team found him on Kudo. We just have to pop off with all their additionals. They definitely got to get the crits there. Because crits are in the way and doing damage, as you can see. Didn't really do nothing there without the crit. Let's see one this time. And this gets good. Yeah, there it is. So that's, that's what we need. Just because we have tight disadvantage here with the two final final coolers, we definitely need to get some crits out. Alright, metal cooler! Yeah, jam what four right into that mountain. Good back there. Ooh, no, no crit on the death drop. How about these death drops? Come and cool, we finish them off, bro. Do it. Nice. You didn't crit that time. You did it on that normal, though. Alright, so this next turn is going to be our last turn. Now, so that first Whis is gone, but we still do have that second Whis active. Um. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Alright. 216k defense. Uh, he isn't really... I mean, he loses his guard. He doesn't have damage reduction. 
He gets extra attack with three or more type T spheres of pain. Oh, he's got a high chance of evading enemies' attack. Well, too bad we can't do that. I mean, I want to I have him finish him off. He shares, like, everything with our large number here once, once you transform with him. And he's got type advantage, plus a wheeze, plus 200k defense. Sheesh. Please. Yeah. Tech Janemba for the win. I mean, I honestly think he's kind of a pile, but he, no, he's good. And of course. I mean, we're, we're looking at this. There's no way uh, goal is a gigantic catastrophe. I'd like to see it. 191k. We eat that up all day. We ain't taking no damage from that. Man. Tech Janemba's gonna finish him off with the lightning shower rain. Look at that. Alright. We did it. First try, actually. That, that, was, that wasn't too bad. I mean, with this team, it worked out pretty well. You know, we got the revive off. We got some active skills activated. Janemba's rage mode. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. So I'll have to, we'll have to do a super team um, tomorrow or something. So yeah, we did it. Let's go take a look at the team we took. I believe Garlic Jr. actually got the job done. I mean, I can believe it. He's he's solid. Good attack and defense. I wish he greatly... I mean, if he greatly stacked... He already greatly stacks attack, but if he's, like, raised defense, or just greatly raised it for one turn at least, if he greatly raised defense, he would be a beast as well. He already is pretty good. Especially with that support, he recovers some HP. Yeah, we got my final form cooler. He's got one dupe in him. A large Nimba as well. Yeah, I'm so glad I pulled a large Nimba, man. I've been waiting to have him. Now we got this new LR metal cooler as well. Both extreme physical LRs, man. Extreme physical for me just got so much better. AGL Metal Cooler with his EZA, man, he's he's pretty solid. He can get the job done as well. Tech Janemba holding his own. Hard to get his support type ability sometimes with four more key spheres, but he, you know, with his guard, you can get his damage reduction with two rainbow key spheres. He, he holds his own pretty well. He can tank. And we got Garlic Jr. supporting. Kind of just floating him around. He worked, worked out pretty well. But alright guys, that was every extreme class type versus AGL Broly in the ultimate red zone. We got the mission, we got our five stones and those tickets or whatever. Um, alright, but let me know what you guys think and what you'd like to see next. And as always, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.